about 38% of American adults have high cholesterol. But how much do we really know about it? Do you even know you have it? Our Dr. Frank McGeorge is here to bust some of the major myths to help you improve your health. Now, in this case, what you don't know can hurt you. Cholesterol is a waxy substance that's found in your blood. First myth, that all cholesterol is bad for you. It's not. Your body actually needs cholesterol to perform essential functions like making hormones and building cells. HDL, or good cholesterol, carries bad cholesterol back to the liver, which then flushes it from the body. Having high levels of good cholesterol can lower your risk for stroke and heart disease. Our guidelines have suggested that lower and lower levels of the bad cholesterol, LDL, are associated with a reduction in the risk of death, heart attack, and stroke. Another myth, if you're not overweight, you won't develop high cholesterol. That's false. While cholesterol can be impacted by diet and weight, high cholesterol can also be genetic. Now, many people believe they would know if they have high cholesterol. That's not true. High cholesterol doesn't usually cause any symptoms until it causes problems, like chest pain, a heart attack, stroke, or even sudden death. That's why regular blood tests are important to detect it early. Another myth? Foods can raise cholesterol but can't lower it. There are actually several foods that can help reduce cholesterol, including whole grains, beans, eggplant, and okra. Now, it's also a myth that you can't do anything to change your cholesterol levels. Some people can improve them simply with diet and exercise. Now, other people need medications called statins. Bottom line, if you don't know your cholesterol numbers, make an appointment with a doctor to get them checked out. 